setting it right with the Fulton County property appraiser. While the Fulton County property appraiser is only doing his job, namely, providing an objective appraisal of your property for taxation purpose, you have the right to question the results of his job. This is especially true when your annual notice of assessment shows an unusually high property valuation, which translates into high property taxes. You can keep the following tips in mind when setting it right, so to speak with the property appraiser. Just keep in mind, too, to keep a cool head throughout the process for a hot-headed attitude will only decrease your chances for getting a fair assessment. Know the rules. You are dealing with the local government, which means that you have to follow the rules and regulations in its jurisdiction. In fact, Following the law is your best chance at getting the Fulton County property appraiser to take another look at your property. For the second appraisal, you may get a more accurate appraisal amount that can work in your favor. Tip: Know the deadline for filing an appeal. Know the methods used and the factors considered by the property appraiser in assessing property values in the jurisdiction. Catch your brakes. The Fulton County property appraiser has a hand in the property tax bill in the sense that the property taxes for payment will be based on his assessed value for your property. But when you want to catch your tax brakes, the best government officials to approach are the Homestead Department in the tax assessor's office. Better yet, you should approach a tax consultant or tax lawyer for more information about the applicable tax breaks in your case. You may be eligible for credits based on your gross income, or on your status as a veteran, disabled person, or senior citizen, or based on your use of the property as your primary home. While you may not have your property's appraised value Lower Day Victory of sorts on the part of the Fulton County property appraiser, your final tax bill may be lower due to these tax breaks or credits. Set your record straight. You also have the right to look at your property's record card. Ask the county assessor's office about it or you may log into the website for more information. Your property's record card will contain crucial information that affects your assessment. This information may include the official description for both your house and the lot it stands on. You can even avoid the appeals process when the assessor determines that there has been a gross mistake in the official description and decides to reduce the assessed value on the spot. For example, if the official description states that you have a four-bedroom, two-story house but you only have a two-bedroom bungalow, you can bring photos as proof. You can ask the assessor to make the necessary corrections including the assessed value, which means a lower tax bill, too. Ultimately, the Fulton County property appraiser is just human with the natural tendency to commit mistakes. You have to work with the property appraiser, not work against him, in order to get a more accurate valuation.